Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. We have a standardized review for you today. Um, this comes from a company that we are ordering from for the first time. Um, the company is North Shore and we ordered their Mega Max. Um, their Mega Max, our shipment, our order, came in a discreet box. I know that that's important. Um, so no um, outstanding features on it. Very discreet. Um, we ordered four of these cases of their Mega Max and they were nice enough to throw in a sample pack of their Supreme Briefs. So we'll be taking a look at those at some point and their Supreme Wipes. So we thank them for those little freebies there that we can um, try out and let you guys know about. So with our standardized review, we always start with packaging. And as I said, it came in a discreet box. They come in pretty plain packaging, pretty straightforward. Um, these come in sets of 10, and we're looking at the large today. North Shore tab style briefs. These are their Mega Max. Um, we see that they come with 10 briefs in a bag. This case, we're looking at the larges, which fits uh, 42 to 54 inches. Um, we see maximum absorbency. Um, great coverage, extra wide and extra long absorbent core, and the refastenable heavy duty tapes with an extra tall landing zone. Very good. So, we always like to compare to our Dry 24 7. As you can tell, they're white, so it's a little difficult to tell the difference here. But this is our Dry 24 7, and this is a Mega Max that I took out and I fluffed so that we can kind of compare fluffed to fluff. Um, about the same thickness when it just comes to a dry one sitting here. When they come out of the bag, they of course look like this. And then this is fluffed. Okay, so that's next to our dry 24 seven. So the tapes, I mentioned that they boast about heavy duty tapes. Let's take a look at those. We have our four tapes. They are clear. They look somewhat like, they look wide, they look hefty. So I really um, appreciate that, good tape there. Um, they also talk about having an extra high landing zone. So they have the reinforced landing zone. And as you can see, it comes all the way up to their elastic waist, which is also a benefit. So a landing strip is important. When it comes to the type of plastic, I already mentioned that it's white. It's kind of right up Kevin's alley. He um, he appreciates the solid colors. So um, there's no distinguishing print or cartoonish print, um, but they do have North Shore written on the wings of the diaper here. As for the plastic, it feels like your standard um, plastic shell. Um, it's a little softer than the Dry 24 seven, so that's kind of nice. And like I said, it does have that elastic waist with the cloth-like feel on the inside. Let's take a look at the core. So looking at the core, when I opened this up, I first noticed right away that it had that honeycomb pattern, much like the peekaboos we reviewed recently. And those had a really high um, absorbency capacity. Uh, North Shore boasts a 6,250 milliliter capacity on this diaper. So I'm really excited to get this um, soaked with some water and, and check that out. But um, softness, it's not super soft. It's pretty much standard, much like your Dry 24-7. It does have the blue absorbency strip in the middle. Um, and thickness-wise, it feels pretty thick. And I am, again, excited about that honeycomb pattern. Let's go ahead and take a look at our measurements. So from leg guard to leg guard, Uh, about pull this up so we can see just over seven and a half inches so we'll say seven and three quarters and let's stretch this out thirty eight inches long okay one other thing I want to talk about while we're here looking at the inside of the diaper is it does have those extra tall 
leg guards. That's really nice. Gives you that extra um, protection. Make helps you make feel secure during the day when you're wearing those. So that's very good. Okay, let's go ahead and lay this on top of our dry 24/7. Here's our dry 24-7. As you know, one of our staples. All white. And here we are comparing it to another all white diaper. Very similar cut. Um, I can tell you right now the tapes are wider than the dry 24-7, so that's good. They look to be about the same length. They both have that elastic waist, but I can tell you that the the uh, North Shore Mega Max has a more streamlined cut. We'll see what that looks like on against Kevin's leg when he models it for us. But that's going to give you a more um, bikini type cut, like we've talked about before. Okay, so that's the Mega Max on top of the Dry 24/7. Very good. Okay. So our next step is going to be to go ahead and fill this with some water and get it on our scale because I'm super excited to see um, how much it weighs. Okay, we've saturated the Mega Max with some water. As you can see, it really bulked up. There's gotta be something to that honeycomb pattern from the Peekaboos and these Mega Max. Like, look at that, that is amazing. So here is our fresh Mega Max out of the package and here it is completely saturated with water. Wow, that is pretty amazing. So our next step is to go ahead and weigh this and let's compare it to our other diapers. This is going to be an interesting weighing segment. So we put our Mega Max by North Shore into our scale. It came out to 5.55 kilograms, which translates to 12.2 pounds. That's amazing. That is our biggest diaper so far, our heaviest diaper so far. So for our next segment, we have Kevin modeling, which as you know, is my favorite part. Okay, Kevin has the North Shore Mega Max on. Again, it's got that typical outer shell plastic here. Um, we have North Shore written on the sides, but overall it's a white solid diaper. Um, it has pretty good fit. It does have good coverage from side to side, and it has that elastic band at the top. That's looking pretty good to me. So, this is the last part of our standardized review of the Mega Max. What are your thoughts? On the diaper. I feel like I'm a walking billboard with those side tabs. Oh, because it just says North Shore on it? All over it. <laughs> I don't understand that part. Other than that, it's all white, which I like. Mm -hmm. And they seem to be pretty absorbent. Yeah. Um, we did try them once this week already. Mm -hmm. Maybe these will be our new staple. The price is right. They're about $2 a diaper wow. right now. That's a really good price point. So that concludes our standardized review of the Mega Max. Thank you for watching. Make sure you check back often. Make sure you like and subscribe. Remember, happiness is a choice and choose wisely.